China takes advantage of high-end technologies to increase its production in agriculture, which results to better and greater production of food products than usual. So with that said, today we are going to take a closer look at some of the most amazing cutting-edge farming system you can find in China. What's up everyone, Arthur is back with something amazing to show you. So don't forget to subscribe and push the bell icon for you to always be updated with our new videos. So without further delay, here we go with our video. Number 1 is Beidou Satellite Navigation System Transforms Agriculture. Modern science and technology are ever-present in Xinjiang. This not only shows in the development of cities, but also areas like agriculture. In southern Xinjiang's Exo Prefecture, China's Beidou Satellite Navigation System is already transforming seating. Number 2 is China's Xinjiang starts harvesting cotton. Shaya County of the Akeso Prefecture in northwest China's Xinjiang Uyghur Autonomous Region, one of the quality cotton production base in the country, has begun to harvest its commodity cotton. The country has more than 80% of its cotton harvested by machines. It takes 10 harvesters to work for a day to pick all of the cotton grown on 120.6 hectares. The Shia County has set up farmers' cooperatives to help 150 administrative villages with growing cotton. Number 3 is Smart Technologies Help Farmers Build Smart Farms. Watch how smart technologies such as Internet of Things and cloud computing are helping farmers build smart farms in East China's Zhejiang province. Daily agricultural production in the farm covering 7,000 plus micrometers mostly relies on smart technologies. Key figures including soil moisture and environmental temperature are transmitted by robots and 5G-based stations to the farmers' cell phones in real time. Number 4 is Highly Mechanized Cotton Harvest in Xinjiang With the development of mechanized cotton harvest in China, over 1 million hectares of cotton in its northwestern Xinjiang Uyghur Autonomous Region have been harvested by machines since 2020. More than 90% of the cotton production in northern Xinjiang is highly mechanized, while southern Xinjiang has raised its mechanization rate to about 40% in cotton harvesting. Number 5 is High Tech Helps Farming Go Smart in South China Self-driving plows, drone that spray pesticides. High-tech agricultural machinery has helped farmers get better access to agricultural know-how in South China's Guangdong province. Number 6 is Automated Farming Being Tested in Northeast China <music> 
tests of unmanned farming systems are being carried out in northeast China's Heilongjiang province. Trials of automation equipment to cultivate common crops including rice, wheat, vegetables, cotton, fruit and tobacco are set to get underway throughout China. Number 7 is White Strawberries Grab Chinese Consumers' Attention White strawberries have recently grabbed the attention of Chinese consumers. Many strawberries that are grown in one greenhouse in East China's Qingdao don't look brightly red, but white or pinkish white. The unique white-colored strawberries have been sold pretty well at a price higher than their conventional counterparts, according to a strawberry farmer. Number 8 is Chinese LED Tech Helps Qatar Develop Farming Industry Chinese LED technologies are being used in Qatar to help develop the farming industry. The company said compared with the traditional agricultural technology, the tech can improve the land use by 30 to 40 times, save water and fertilizer by more than 90%. Number 9 is Harvesting Chilies in Northwest China's Xinjiang As the fields turn red, farmers are busy cutting and reaping. One of these machines does the work of 500 laborers saving both time and money. The climate in Xinjiang is ideal for growing chilies, with abundant sunshine and temperatures that soar in the day, plummet at night. And that's all there is to it for today. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe and share this with others. Once again, this is Arthur. Thanks for watching and see you in our next video.